Hello students, welcome to our today's lesson. In our today's lesson, we will learn about molarity of the solution, molarity of the solution, normality and mole fraction of the solution. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to define mole fraction, molarity, equivalent mass, number of equivalents, normality and molality of the solution. Calculate mole fraction, molarity, normality and molality of a solution from a given set of information. Molarity, denoted by capital M. Molarity of a solution is the number of moles of solutes in a given quantity of solution, in a given volume of solution. Therefore, molarity, molarity, molarity equal number of mole of solutes, number of mole of solutes divided by volume of the solution in litre. But number of mole of solutes equal mass of the solutes divided by molar mass of the solute times volume of the solution in a litre. Units of molarity is mole per litre, mole per litre, mole per litre, which is known as molar capital M. For example, what is the molarity of a solution containing 0.32 moles of sodium chloride in 3.4 liters? Solution. Molarity of the solution, capital M, equal number of moles of solute divided by volume of the solution in liter. Number of moles of solute is 0.32 moles, equal 0.32 mole, divided by volume of the solution in liter is 3.4 liter, 3.4 liter. Now this is 0.94 mole per liter, which is known as molar, capital M. Example two, calculate the molarity of a solution made by dissolving 23.4 gram of sodium sulfate in enough water to form 125 milliliter of solution. Molar mass of sodium sulfate is 142 gram per mole. Let us do together. Molarity capital M, molarity of the solution, equal number of mole of solute divided by volume of the solution. But number of mole of solute is mass of solute divided by molar mass of the solute times volume of the solution in liter. Mass of solute is 23.4 gram, 23.4 gram of sodium sulfate, 23.4 gram divided by molar mass of the solute is 142 gram per mole, 142 gram per mole times volume of the solution in liter. 125 milliliter is volume of the solution. You have to convert it into liter because the units of molarity is mole per liter, which is known as molar. 125 milliliter is the same as 0.125 liter. This equal 1.332 mole per liter. Mole per liter equal 1.32 molar. Molar. Molality denoted by the symbol small m. Molality of the solution. Molality of the solution is number of moles of solutes per 
kilogram of solvent. Therefore, molality small m equal number of mole of solutes divided by mass of solvent in kilogram. Mass of solvent, mass of solvent in kg in kilogram. Number of mole of solutes is mass of solute divided by molar mass of the solute times kilogram of the solvent. Kilogram of the solvent. Kilogram of the solvent. Or mass of the solvent in kg. The units of molality is mole per kg, which is known as molal. Units of molality. Units of molality is mole per kg equal molal, small m, molal. For example, what is the molality of a solution containing 0.46 mole of solutes in 2 kg of water? You are asked to calculate molality of a solution. One way of expressing concentration of a solution is using molality. Therefore, molality, small m, equal number of mole of solutes divided by mass of solvent in kilogram, kg of solvent, kilogram of solvent. Number of mole of solute is 0 0.46 mole, 0 0.46 mole, divided by kilogram of solvent in 2 kg of water. 2 kilogram kg. 0 0.46 divided by 2 is 0 0.23 equal 0 0.23 molal. 0 0.23 molal is molality of this solution. Example 2. A solution is made by dissolving 4.35 gram of glucose in 25 milliliter of water at 25 degrees centigrade. Calculate the molality of glucose in the solution. Water has a density of 1 gram per milliliter. What do you do? You are asked to calculate molality of this solution. Now, molality, molality, small m, molality of the solution, molality, equal number of mole of solute number of mole of solute divided by kilogram of the solvent kg of solvent solvent but number of mole of solutes is mass of the solute mass of the solute divided by molar mass of the solute times kilogram of the solvent of the solvent kilogram of the solvent now molality small m equal mass of solute is 4.35 gram glucose 4.35 gram glucose divided by molar mass of glucose molar mass of glucose is 180 gram per mole 180 gram per mole times mass of the solvent in kg here what is given volume of water and density of water is given we can calculate mass of water from density and volume density by definition density of water equal mass of water divided by volume of water from this mass of water mass of water h2o equal density of water which is one gram per milliliter one gram per milliliter times times volume of water is 25 milliliter 25 milliliter milliliter this will be cancelled by this we are left with gram which is the units of mass therefore mass of water mass of water is 25 gram 25 gram not that for dilute aqueous solution for dilute aqueous solution if density of the solution is one gram per milliliter 
One milliliter is approximately equal to one gram. If density is one gram per milliliter density. Therefore, mass of water is 25 gram, 0 0.025 kilogram. Molality equal 4.35 gram divided by molar mass of the solids 180 gram per mole times times mass of the solvent in cage, which is 0 0.025 kilogram. Gram will be cancelled by gram. We are left with mole per cage, which is the units of molality. Now 4.35 divided by 180 times 0 0.025 is 0 0.97 molal. 0 0.97 molal is molality of the solution. Molality of the solution. Okay, normality denoted by capital letter N. Normality of the solution is number of equivalent of solutes per liter of solution. Normality denoted by the symbol capital N. Normality equal number of equivalent equivalent of solute number of equivalent of solute divided by volume of the solution in liter volume of the solution in liter number of equivalent of solutes equal mass of the solute divided by equivalent mass of the solute times volume of the solution in liter we can write this as mass of the solute divided by equivalent mass of the solute is molar mass of the solute divided by Z. Molar mass of the solute divided by Z times volume of the solution. Here, Z for an acid is number of hydrogen ions released by one formula unit of the acid. For a base, Z is number of OH minus furnished by the given base. For a salt, Z is total positive valence. For oxidation reduction reaction, Z is total number of electrons gained or released by the given reaction. Therefore, normality of the solution equal M times Z m times z divided by molar mass times volume of the solution this can be written as mass divided by molar mass is number of mole of the solids small n n times z divided by volume of the solution from this number of equivalents of solutes equal number of mole of solid times z number of equivalent number of equivalents of the solute equal number of mole of the solute times z. What is the relation between normality and molarity? Normality, normality equal number of mole of solute divided by volume is molarity of the solution. This is molarity of the solution. Therefore, normality equal N divided by V is molarity. Molarity capital M times Z of the solution. This is the relation between normality and molarity. Normality equal molarity times Z. Molarity times Z. For example, calculate the normality and molarity of a solution that contains 16.2 gram of the salt iron sulfate molar mass of iron sulfate is 400 gram per mole in 200 milliliter solution you are asked to calculate molarity and normality of this solution normality solution normality normality equal number of equivalents divided by volume of the solution Therefore, normality equal M times Z divided by molar mass times volume of the solution. 
mass of the solute times Z divided by molar mass times volume of the solution equal small m is mass of the solute, which is 16.2 gram, 16.2 gram times Z for a salt is total positive valence. The salt is iron sulfate. Total positive valence, total positive valence of iron, iron, its valence is plus 3. Here we have two iron atoms. Therefore, total positive valence is 6. 6. For one iron, the valence is 3. For two iron, the total is 6. Therefore, 6 equivalent per mole, equivalent per mole, divided by molar mass of the solute, molar mass of iron sulfate, which is 400 gram per mole, 400, 400 gram per mole, times volume of the solution in litre. Volume of the solution is 200 milliliter. This must be converted into litre because the units of normality is equivalent per litre. 200 milliliter in liter is 0 0.2 liter. Gram will be cancelled by gram. Mole will be cancelled by mole. We are left with equivalent per liter, which is the unit of normality. Therefore, 16.2 times 6 equivalent divided by 400 times 0 0.2 liter is 1.215 normal, 1.215 equivalent per liter, which is normal, 1.215 normal. What is the molarity of this solution? As we said, the relation between normality and molarity, this normality equal molarity times Z. From this molarity of the solution equal normality divided by Z. Normality of the solution is 1.215 equivalent per liter. 1.215 equivalent per liter divided by Z is total positive valence, which is 6 equivalent per mole. 6 equivalent per mole. Equivalent will be cancelled by equivalent. We are left with mole per liter, which is the unit of molarity, is molar. Therefore, 1.215 divided by 6 is 0 0.203 molar, 203 molar is molarity of this solution. Mole fraction denoted by this symbol is mole fraction. If the solution has a solvent and the solute, a mole fraction gives a concentration at the ratio of moles of one component to the total moles present in the solution. If a solution contains solutes and a solvent, then mole fraction of the solute, mole fraction of the solute, mole fraction of the solid equal number of mole of the solid, number of mole of the solid divided by number of mole of the solution, number of mole of the solution. Mole fraction of the solvent, mole fraction of the solvent equal number of mole of the solvent, number of mole of the solvent divided by number of mole of the solution, number of mole of the solution. Not that number of mole of solution is the sum of number of mole of solute and number of mole of solvent. Mole fraction add up to give one. Therefore, mole fraction of the solute, mole fraction of the solute plus mole fraction of the solvent equal one. For example, one mole of alcohol is mixed with three moles of water. 
calculate the mole fraction of alcohol and water. You are asked to calculate mole fraction of the solutes and mole fraction of the solvent. Let us do together. Solution. Mole fraction of the solid, mole fraction of alcohol, equal number of mole of alcohol divided by number of mole of solution. Number of mole of solution. Number of mole of alcohol is one mole. One mole. Divided by number of mole of solution. Number of mole of solution is number of mole of solids plus number of mole of solvents, which is one mole plus three mole is four mole divided by four mole. Four mole. Mole will be cancelled by mole. Therefore, mole fraction has no unit. One divided by four is 0 0.25. 0 0.25. This is mole fraction of alcohol in this solution. What is the mole fraction of water? Mole fraction of the solvent. Mole fraction of water. Mole fraction of water equal number of mole of water. Number of mole of water divided by number of mole of solution. Number of mole of solution. Number of mole of water is three mole. Three mole. Three mole divided by number of mole of solution is number of mole of solid plus number of mole of solvents which is one plus three is four mole four mole mole will be cancelled by mole three divided by four is 0 0.75 mole fraction has no unit you see mole fraction add up to give one Mole fraction of the solid plus mole fraction of the solvent equal 1. Mole fraction of the solid alcohol is 0 0.25 plus mole fraction of the solvent is 0 0.75 equals 1. Students, let us do this question. So that you can practice what you have just learned. You have two minutes. Good. How did you do it? Let us do together. What is the mole fraction of a solid in one molar aqueous solution? What is the mole fraction of a solid in one molar aqueous solution? 
mole fraction of the solid solution mole fraction of the solid mole fraction of the solid equal number of mole of solute divided by number of mole of solution which is number of mole of solute number of mole of solute plus number of mole of the solvent what is given molality of the solution molality of the solution is one molal as we said molality is defined as molality equal number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kg kilogram of solvent kg of solvent kilogram of solvent which is one molal one molal means one mole of solute is dissolved in one kilogram of solvent one mole of solute one mole of solute solute dissolved in one kilogram of solvent one kg of water one kg of water because the solvent is water it says aqueous solution aqueous solution from this number of mole of solute is one mole number of mole of solute number of mole of solute equal one mole mass of solvent is 1 kilogram mass of water mass of water equal 1 kilogram 1 kilogram in gram kilo is 10 to the power of 3 therefore this is 1000 gram 1000 gram you can calculate number of mole of water from its mass number of mole of water number of mole of water equal mass of water mass of water divided by molar mass of water mass of water here is 1000 gram 1000 gram divided by molar mass of water molar mass of water hydrogen two plus oxygen 16 is 18 gram per mole 18 gram per mole 18 gram per mole Therefore, number of mole of water, number of mole of water equal 1,000 divided by 18 is 55.56, 55.56 mole. This is number of mole of water. Now, mole fraction of the solute, mole fraction of the solute, mole fraction of the solute equal number of mole of solute, number of mole of solute is 1 mole one mole one mole divided by number of mole of solution which is the sum of number of mole of solute and number of mole of solvents number of mole of solute is one mole one mole plus number of mole of solvents is 55.56 mole 55.56 mole mole fraction of the solutes mole fraction of the solute equal 1 divided by 1 plus 55.56 is 0 0.018 0 0.018 mole fraction has no unit students in our today's lesson we learned molarity of the solution molarity is defined as number of moles of solute per liter of solution molarity is one way of expressing concentration of a solution molality of the solution is defined as number of moles of solutes per kilogram of solvent normality of the solution is number of equivalents of solutes per liter of solution mole fraction of solutes is number of mole of solute divided by number of mole of solution mole fraction of the solvent is number of mole of solvent divided by number of mole of solution this brings us to the end of our today's lesson until next time goodbye